back in the days, my mom used to make uh, pain perdu using stale bread or brioche or pain de mie. So it's totally up to you. Of course, if you use something richer, it's going to taste better. I am Bruno Albuz. Thank you again for watching The Real Deal Cooking Channel. Stay tuned. Let's do the butter. Half and a half, sugar, eggs, a tiny bit of cinnamon. You know, I am not a fan of cinnamon, but just a little, a little dash, a little hint, a little something, just to feel the aftertaste of the spice. You don't want something too strong because it can definitely turn into an unpleasant experience. Dark rum, a couple of teaspoons, blend. That's it. Do you remember all these things? The kugloff? I'm going to cut them into three portions and soak them in the egg a uh, half and a half mixture for two hours. By the time my brioche or kugloff slices are soaking in the egg a uh, half and a half mixture, I am going to make my chutney. I'm going to cube my dry fruits, apricots, figs, uh, pruno, and dates. Well, I'm going to saute my dry fruits with some butter. Then I am going to add a dash of blue agave syrup. Well, you can use white or brown sugar as well. Then I'm gonna cook it for a couple of minutes, then deglaze with apple cider vinegar and cook for five minutes more on low heat. Transfer to a bowl and clean the frying pan. Meanwhile, make a quick apricot marmalade. Cut apricot into cubes, throw some butter in a hot frying pan and saute apricots and sugar for a couple of minutes on high heat. Then put the lid on and let cook for 5 minutes on low heat. Then mix in the dried fruit mixture, the toasted and crushed walnuts and pistachios. Last touch up, a drizzle of kirsch, but that's totally optional, but of course, much better with. Next, I'm going to drain those awesome back-to-life kugloff slices, brioche or bread, it's again totally up to you. And seal them in a hot frying pan with butter until cooked through though, about 3 minutes on each side. Well, done deal. Serve the just warm French toast with this luscious dried fruit chutney. One of a kind French toast. To get the full recipe, go to brunoskitchen.net. Please subscribe, like me on Facebook, and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Pinterest. Well, you know what you should do next Sunday morning. <laughs>